the gift that Jim McAvale gave to those 100 veterans, Bill. Yeah, those veterans were actually just treated to a nice dinner at Pappas Barbecue. They're on their way to the stadium as we speak, and they are ready to root on our Astros. This is absolutely unbelievable, you know. Like, I've been an Astros fan since I was a little kid. My dad took me to Astros games when we sucked and they were cheap tickets. And now I get to take my son to his first Astros game. Just 24 hours ago, Mattress Smack visited with veterans at Camp Hope. Now he's treating 100 of them to game one of the World Series. These are great veterans who have given their all for us. And uh, uh, I went out the other day to a speech there. It was totally inspired. So sending 100 veterans to Camp Hope. Jim McInvale, also known as Mac to Friends, is a busy man. He's a hands-on kind of guy when it comes to overseeing his stores. That same approach is taken when it comes to our veterans and their needs. I never served, but I've seen, uh, you know, the, the trauma that these guys have been through. And, and Camp Hope was one of many places in Houston that takes care of veterans with PTSD. And it just gives all of us at Gallery Friends a great joy to be able to help these veterans again who've done so much while I did so little. Camp Hope, located in northwest Houston, provides interim housing for wounded warriors and their families. Warriors suffering from combat-related PTSD. They have 83 uh, vets that live on the site full time and you know they've got depression issues, uh, PTSD issues and Camp Hope helps them get back into uh, a normal life, helps them find jobs, find careers. You know, incredible. He's one heck of a guy. And Max says he got an extra 12, 12, 12 tickets before the game. He will be giving those to donors from Camp Hope to for thanking them for giving veterans a second chance. Live from Minute Maid Park, Bill Barajas, KPRC, Channel 2 News.